this is the full system of the Mac OS Sierra in your iDevice. Hi everyone, this is Danny for Dude Tech and welcome back with another beautiful video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys something specific and it's going to be really amazing if you want to set it on your iDevice. And what I'm talking here right now, I'm talking about how you can set up a Mac OS Sierra on your iDevice. And this is going to be, it's not. I'm not talking here about a theme, I'm not talking here about something which is going to be kind of like a fake no it's going to be real and i'm going to be showing you guys in this video how you can set that just make sure to stick around to the end of the video i don't want you to miss any one of the setup that i'm going to be telling you guys about it so make sure to stick around to the end of the video and i'm going to be showing you guys step by step how you can set that on your iDevice let's get it started Okay, so the first thing that you need to make sure that you have a jailbroken device. You need to have a CDN in your device in order to make that happen. And then you need to add the source, which you will be find in the description below for you guys. And this is the source, what I'm talking about, which is going to be the genesiphone.com. And then the source here in the bottom, which is, as I said, you will be found in the description below. So make sure you add that source. And then from there, you're going to be run the CDA. And then after that, you're going to be just uh, go to the same source that I give it to you guys. From there, you need to go look for the add-ons, which is going to be the front page. You will be just up on the front page here. And you, this is the front page source here that uh, you have to download it first and then after that you're going to be download the theme which is going to be this one here in the bottom okay so if we go ahead right now and tap on the front page here and then as you guys can see right now we are in the front page here so you have to make sure before you download the front page that you need to create it an account because you have to purchase for this one here in order to set everything on your iDevice. How is that gonna be cost? It's cost you $10. Yeah, it's cost you $10. So in order to set up everything in your iDevice, you need to purchase for that tweak and the theme as well. So the both is gonna be $10. I'm not gonna be talking about something is separate. No, the both is gonna be $10. So let's talk about the front page. So after you created an account, and then after that, you will be receiving email from the developer approved your password and the account that you already created from there you will be allowed from uh, that time to uh, download the tweak which is the source and the theme as well so once you set up everything and then you already pay so you go ahead right now with if I here press on it and then just press on the install from there just Go ahead and confirm that and then you need to just wait a little bit okay so after everything is done just go ahead and reset and respring your device okay so after you're done from everything launch your device and then you need to go to the settings scroll down till you see the front page that you already download so let me just take a look this is the front page here i'm gonna be just click on it and then this is what you need to do so first of all enable the tweak here and then after that place the view on the top of the icons just make sure to turn that on and then you have another option here so you have to take care of it which is going to be the high springboard status bar so once you just turn that on i'm going to be press on the show menu here once you press on it you will be see that page right there so i'm going to be press on it here it will be showing me this is the basically the source that I already download which is you have all the information here in order to download the theme after that so we are good and then with the uh, once I switch the view on the front and the back I just want to make sure everything is correct I'm gonna be leave that on on just like so what I'm gonna be do right now I'm gonna be go back to Cydia I'm going to be close that right now. Launch Cydia, go back to the sources, look for the same source that I told you guys about it, which is this one here. Go back to the add-ons in the same front page here. And then you need right now to download the theme. So the same process, modify here and then install. 
you wait a little bit and then just confirm that and then we're gonna be wait a little bit right now to finish downloading the theme okay so go ahead right now and just respring your device go ahead again and just go back to the settings and go back to the same front page that i already told you guys about it which is going to be the one that you download which is going to be the one here the front page and i'm going to be go right now to the show menu here and this is the theme that you already download which is i already download so i'm going to be top on a the theme right now and then as you guys can see right now the whole set is right now is got being changed the dock here the background the status bar the uh the apple icon here this is the full system of the mac os sierra in your iDevice, which is going to be really amazing so let me just go through right now some things to show you guys and approve you guys that is going to be the mac os on your iDevice. it's not just the theme it's not just icons here so if i top on the apple logo here just like the mac os and if i want to go to about and as you guys can see this is the os the mac os on your iDevice. just go ahead and top on this here i'm gonna be top on the apple logo here which is gonna be my menu from now on and then you have some other stuff here that you can go through for example it's gonna be the system and uh, this is the app store is gonna be uh, you can run it from here this is the cdia and then you have the springboard from here the sleep mode and then install if you want to install something and this is the terminal if you want to disable something or add any kind of thing into your mac os system using your iDevice. you guys can see here the settings as you guys can see this is all your apps that you're running on switcher this is all your information this is your notification center here let me just swipe if you want to swipe from the let me just get back here swipe from the left to the right this is your weather this is your music if you want to listen for your music and then even if you swipe from the right to the left this is most of the settings that you have on your iDevice but it comes in files just like the mac os really beautiful and nice set if you want to run the mac os on your iDevice. the launcher here just like the mac os the same stuff press on it and it's going to be take you to all your apps on your iDevice. just like so how beautiful that is really nice and amazing the the developer really made a beautiful job about that so this is how you can download the uh, mac os on your iDevice, and as i show you guys it's not that much complicated process it's easy to do it just you need to follow up all the steps and once you download it you will be enjoy a lot with it that's it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed today's video i just want to share that tweak with you guys and i hopefully you guys are gonna be like it catch you guys in next video peace